Welcome to PMC Applicant Portal. In this video we will be walking you through the application process. To get started, go to pmc.almasnet.com and click on the sign up button to create a new account. After entering your full name, you need to enter your CNIC, B form or NICOP number to indicate your nationality. To complete the sign up, you can either use your email ID or phone number. You will receive your verification code on your chosen platform. Enter a password that falls within the specified requirements and click Next. You will now be asked to enter the PIN code for verification sent to you on your phone or email ID. If you used your email ID, you will receive an email like this. Don't forget to check your spam folder as well. Copy the PIN code into the empty box and click on Create Account. Now you will be taken to a new screen that prompts you to select your nationality. If you are a Pakistani, select the local applicant option, and the MDCAT option will be automatically selected. Now click on the Start button to proceed. In the My Profile section, proceed by uploading a formal photo of yourself, like so. Then enter your remaining biographical details such as date of birth and gender. Also add in your contact details such as your mobile and landline number. Then add in your mailing address and if it's the same as your permanent address, click on same as above. Your citizenship details will be pre-filled. Click save to save your personal details. Now, enter your father or guardian details. Click Save again and proceed to Education. If you have done A-Levels, you will have to input marks according to the IBCC equivalency. Here we will select FSC. Enter the rest of the details such as your institution name, degree awarding board and obtained marks. Your percentage will be automatically calculated. Upon completing this section, click Save. In the test section, enter your MDCAT roll number and if it's valid, your result will be automatically updated in the portal, like so. In the last section, upload all the required attachments by clicking on Upload Document. You can also check any document you have uploaded by clicking on the button next to Upload Document to download it. If you want to re-upload it, then click on Document Attached. Once you have uploaded all the required documents, click Save. If your profile is complete, My Applications section will be enabled. Here, you can select your preferences for medical college from the list by clicking on Select Courses. You need to select at least one. Similarly, if you are applying to dental colleges, select at least one from the list. Don't forget to click Save. Now check the undertaking statement and click Save. After clicking on the preview button, a new tab will open the application in PDF format so the applicant can review all the data entered. After finishing the My Application section, the applicant must hit the Submit button and press the Confirm button. The next section is the Application Fee section. In order to complete this section, the applicant must press the Print Bill button on the top right corner. This will open the bill in a new tab in PDF format. The bill must be printed, and the payment must be made to any MCB bank branch. After the payment has been made, the proof of payment must be uploaded to the website. To do this, press the Upload Receipt button, and upload your receipt in PDF or JPEG format. After this press the Done button, and the page should display a message. 
payment verification from bank is pending. You may reload the web page to check if the bank has verified the payment. Once the bank has verified the payment, the following message should display. Thank you for watching the video and good luck with your application process.